Hello students. Let us start chapter 2nd of class 10 the mathematics polynomials. Before going into the details, we are just revising what we have learned in class 9. What is a polynomial? A polynomial is an algebraic expression in which the power or exponent of the variable is a whole number. This is what we have learned in class 9. Let us see a few examples. First, 2x square minus 3x plus 7. Here let us exp explain the power of the variable. Variable is x. In the first term, the power of the variable x is 2. In the second term, the power of the variable x is 1. And in the third term, the power of the variable x is 0. So, 0, 1 and 2, all these are whole numbers. Therefore, to satisfy the definition of polynomials, that the power of the variables is a whole number. So, this algebraic expression is a polynomial. Now, let us look into the second example. Root 3 x raised to 5 plus 5 by 2 x raised to 3 plus 6 x minus 4. When we examine the power of these variables, that is variable x, see, in the first term, power of variable x is 5, in second term, 3, in the third term, 1, and in the last term, the power of the variable x is 0. 0, 1, 3, 5 are all whole numbers. Therefore, this algebraic expression is a polynomial in the variable x. Well, let us see the third example. Root 2x plus 5. When we examine the power of the variable x in the first term, the power of the variable x is 1 and in the second term 0. 0 and 1 are whole numbers. Therefore, this 2 is a polynomial in one variable x. Now, go to fourth example. Root x plus 5x square minus 3. To find out whether it is a polynomial or not, we will have to examine the power of the variables in each term. The first term, root x is written as x raised to 1 upon 2. Second term, plus 5x square minus 3x raised to 0. Minus 3 is written as minus 3x raised to 0. When we examine the powers 0, 2, 1 by 2, all these are not whole numbers because 1 by 2 is not a whole number. Therefore, it does not satisfy the definition as the power of each variable, variable in each term is not whole number. So, it is not a polynomial. Now, let us look into fifth example, 1 upon x raised to 2. When we, this 1 upon x raised to 2 can be written as x raised to minus 2. Here, when you see the power, the power of the variable is minus 2, which is not a whole number. Therefore, it is also not a polynomial. Let us conclude from our from our discussion these things. An algebraic expression in which the power of the variable in each term of the expression is a whole number. The general form of a polynomial is a0 plus a1x plus a2x square plus a3x raised to 3 plus etc. an x raised to n where a0, a1, a2, a3, etc. an are real numbers and n is a whole number. Then it is called a polynomial in x of degree n. 
another point zero is called zero polynomial when do we get zero polynomial when all the coefficients a0 a1 a2 a3 etc an they each one of them is zero the whole polynomial becomes zero such a polynomial is called zero polynomial now root 2 root 3 5 by 2 etc that's a constants they are called a constant polynomial the degree of constant polynomial is zero because root 2 can be written as root 2 x raised to 0 3 can be written as 3 x raised to 0 and so on therefore the, the degree of constant polynomial is 0 next point a polynomial of degree 1 is called a linear polynomial the standard form of linear polynomial is ax plus b where a not equal to 0 b can be 0 but a cannot be 0 a and b are real numbers next point a polynomial of degree 2 is called a quadratic polynomial the standard form of quadratic polynomial is ax square plus bx plus c where a not equal to 0 b and c can be 0 a polynomial of degree 3 is called a cubic polynomial the standard form of a cubic polynomial is ax raised to 3 plus bx square plus cx plus d where a not equal to 0 next point what is the degree of a polynomial degree of a polynomial is the highest power of the variable in the polynomial and the degree of zero polynomial is not defined it's an important point to be noted now let us come to some assignments hoping that you understood all these this uh, topic we have studied in class 9 so it is just it is a uh, revision now you may try these assignments the assignment question is identify the following polynomials from the list of algebraic expressions identify polynomials from the list of algebraic expressions first 4 by 3 x square plus 3 x minus 5 second root 2 x square minus root x third y square plus 2 upon y and fourth x square minus 2x plus 2 by 3. The answer to this part will be given you in the next edition.